Hi guys, my name is Jisoo Kim and I'm the TA for the Norris Comprehensive Cancer Center, sponsored by the Cancer STEM program, which is part of the USC Medical STEM program. I typically teach second graders at Alexander Science Center School here in Los Angeles, but today I'll be teaching you all about lungs during our part of the pulmonology unit. So what is pulmonology? Pulmonology is a field in medicine that studies the disease of the respiratory systems or the lungs. Now remember, pulmon means lung in Spanish and ology means the study of. So if you put those two together, you basically have the study of lungs. And how do we breathe? The diaphragm is a muscle in our body that's, that helps us inhale and exhale. When we breathe in, inhale, our diaphragm contracts or gets shorter or gets smaller. But when we exhale or breathe out, our diaphragm expands. And on the right, you can see a little imagery or a little video of how our diaphragm helps us breathe. Now, when we breathe, the air we breathe in is made of mostly nitrogen and oxygen. But when we breathe out, we mostly breathe out carbon dioxide which is waste that our cells produce. And why do we need oxygen? Our cells need oxy oxygen to create energy and they need this energy to work and function properly. So it's very important that we're breathing in oxygen and after we breathe in, our cells create waste, which is CO2, and we exhale that out. And our scientist highlight for the week is René Lenec, and he was a French physician who is credited with the invention of the stethoscope. Um, prior to this really important invention, doctors had to put their ears to the patient's chest in order to hear their breathing and their heartbeat. But with Lenec's invention, the chest sounds were amplified, so they were a lot louder. And the, visit, and the physicians no longer needed to be in an uncomfortable position of having their ear to the patient's chest, which as you can imagine, can be quite personal and more invasive. So the stethoscope that he created, which you can see on the image in the bottom, just amplifies the sound of the heartbeat. And that is all for this week on pulmonology. I hope you guys enjoyed this lesson and we'll see you next week. Bye.